told us that you have questions about your slow cooker's digital controls. So we went right to our Crock-Pot brand team to get you all the answers. So let's take a closer look. There are actually only three main types of slow cooker digital controls. Countdown, Smart Pot, and Illum touchscreen technology. In this video, we'll focus on the Countdown slow cooker digital controls, but you can also find similar how-to videos just like this one for the Smart Pot and the Illum touchscreen technology slow cookers. But right now, let's get cooking and show you how to make the most of your Countdown digital slow cooker. While the physical controls may vary by model, all countdown control panels always have two arrow buttons and a digital time screen. To get started, fill the slow cooker at least half to three quarters full with your meal ingredients for optimal cooking and then plug in your slow cooker. Select the high or low cooking temperature as indicated on your recipe by pressing the select button. To set the cooking time, press the time arrows to scroll through the timed cooking options. The time can be set in increments of 30 minutes for a total cooking time of up to 20 hours. Once set, the time will begin to count down in one minute increments. And here's a quick tip. Don't cook on the warm setting, which is only for keeping already cooked food at the perfect serving temperature. When the cooking time has completed, your slow cooker will automatically shift to the warm setting and the orange light will illuminate. But remember, it's not recommended to keep your foods warming for more than four hours. And that's it. You're ready to enjoy a delicious meal cooked in your countdown digital slow cooker. To turn the Crock-Pot slow cooker off, simply press the off or power button and unplug the unit from the outlet. We hope these tips will help you to enjoy effortless, delicious slow-cooked meals for years to come. See below for a link.